and interests or skill from my childhood that's carried me through today. Self-confidence. Uh, I've always liked me. And there's something about knowing who you are and liking you, regardless of what anybody else has to say. Uh, I think that has a lot to do with how I'm able to navigate and do the things that I do, because I'm not second guess guessing myself. Um, um, and I've always been a person, even when I was little, to be able to ask that question, you know, to, to be able to observe what's going on and get to the one question that nobody wants to ask, but needs to be asked. Um, I have that skill and I don't know how I do, but I've always had it, uh, to, to be unabashedly bright. Um, my brothers even talk about me now because they, you know, they would say, you know, you were just a little annoyance because uh, I wouldn't let them uh, get over on me because I was little or I was the only girl. Um, they, they, and I remember doing this, I was really little. Uh, they would take the funny papers, you know, the comics, and they would keep them from me. And um, I learned to read upside down because they wouldn't let me have the comics. But I wouldn't let them have them alone. So I would be on the upside of the paper looking upside down and reading because I wouldn't let them outdo me. Um, or, or the time that I would always get in trouble for climbing that tree that I wasn't supposed to be in because they kept telling me I was a girl and I couldn't do it. And then I would make sure that they knew that I could do it because I didn't care that I got in trouble, but I went up to the top of that tree. Uh, just those kind of things, you know, I just wouldn't be put down. I wouldn't be put in a corner. Um, I wouldn't be ignored. Um, and I wouldn't allow myself to be put away in such a way that I wasn't able to have an intelligent conversation. It, it just, I just wouldn't stand for it. Uh, there was something about me, I, you know, I was always inquisitive, I read a lot. Um, my family gave us a lot of experiences. We traveled and we saw things that most kids from our neighborhood didn't. Um, and, you know, I just used all of that. Um, and I never planned on failure. You know, uh, not getting, not reaching my goal was never something I considered. It was just a matter of how long it would take. It wasn't if I was going to get there or not.